गुड मॉर्निंग टू ऑल ऑफ यू गुड मॉर्निंग सर अच्छा तो फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल आज के टेस्ट दिल तो टेस्ट आगामीकाल देव तो फार्ष्ट जानते चाहिए तुम्हारे इे जो क्वेश्चन आन्सार्सगुलो सेगलते को डाउट आ तो टुएल्व थार्टीन एंड फोर्टीन मध्य डाउट आरो को डाउट आरिता रिम्पा स्वर्णाली तुम्हारे को डाउट आ मेन्शनिंग रुटीन So first of all, uh, what is cursor? When an SQL statement in process, uh, when an SQL statement is processed, Oracle create a memory known as context area. A cursor is a pointer to this context area. It contains all information needed for processing the statement. In PL SQL, the context area is controlled by cursor. A cursor contains informations on a select statement and rows of data accessed by it. So, uh, cursor is nothing a memory location. So, or that can be a pointer which is controlled at the time of select statement is fetched. so not only select for any dml statement uh, like your insert update delete select all so cursor can be classified into two parts those are implicit cursor and explicit cursor implicit cursors kake bolbo so implicit cursor that means we having one table let we have one simple example we are describing the example this is the table for the customers the customers having is id customer having its own name customer having its age customer having its address and customer having its salary so there should be one uh, there should be one cursor by that cursor we have to increment the salary by 5000 so that will be the uh, flat increment by the company so each and every employee salary will be incremented by 5000 that can be created using a cursor 
how to create those declare total row number so cursor is same like the procedure in our procedure what code we have written cursor similar like that first we have to declare the cursor so declare total row numbers so declare the column name so uh, we are declaring the column name that is total row numbers so begin update customer set salary equals to salary plus 5000 so update customers that means update table name set field name so update customer is the table name set field name is the salary salary should be the previous salary plus 5000 if sql not found then no customer updated and else if sql found then total row will be the uh, sql row count that means how many number of rows are there that will be shown and the five data or seven data the total row uh, of customer is updated that will show so amra jodi code ta ke run korai tahole amra ki korbo let we are running this code Starting our PLSQL developer. We are typing the username and password, then press enter. Now we are taking one new SQL window. New SQL window we are taking. In that SQL window we have to run the code. We are not writing the code again. Just we are copying the code from there and pasting it. So first we have to create this table. First we have to create this table. So Okay, first we are creating the table. Customer twenty seven is the table is there. Select star from customer twenty seven. Okay. So just we want to uh, update this table. So for that reason, we are taking another SQL window. The uh, table name is customer twenty seven. So. We are copying this code and pasting it on the SQL window and change 
change customer 27 as the table name okay there should not be the line numbers That is executed. So now we want to see the table again. save it we are again saving it just we are closing the database to refresh it just we want to close this देखो, 5000, 5000 दो बार ऐड होएगा छे, तो that should be 13000. Clear? Pass the value as 3000 and 5000. So 5000 and 5000 added twice because I run this cursor two times. Clear? तो मैं देखते पहले हम कि आउटपुट तो बोल लाम। हाँ सर, हाँ सर। सुखी बोल लाम। अम्म एक कोड तो दुबारा रन करा लाम। कार सेक्टर। सो कार सर ये अपन की बोले ची। सो यूजिंग द कार सर वी आर डूइंग द इंस्ट्रक्शंस टू अपडेट द सैलरी बाय 5000 so we run this cursor twice so for that reason that is updated two times okay and first time i have given the salary of ram is 3000 and ajay is 5000 after running this cursor twice 5000 and 5000 salary has been incremented by 10000 so the salary has become uh, 13000 and 15000 okay so कार्यसरे मेनली कास्टा की हाँ अब बोलो हम क्यों बोलेंगे कार्यसरे मेनली कास्टा की सर मैंने कि मैंने कास्टा टकी काजी की क्या नोकी लाइन देता है तो हाँ हाँ वन इज़ नॉर्मल हाँ ओके वी कैन अपडेट दिस यूजिंग द नॉर्मल अपडेट वेल व्हाई वी यूज कास्टा ठीक तो ठीक सर uh, actually, 
in uh, in database whenever we will not use the cursor cursor is the pointer so if we compare this program using the c we can easily identify where we will use the uh, cursor so in c there are the several types of program using the pointer or non using the pointer we have done two programs like uh, swap two numbers using um, swap two numbers so we don't use pointer in this case just we swap those numbers using a third variable how to swap uh, that can be swap using the uh, third variable so what will be the process i'm showing you How to swap? A equals to 10, B equals to 5. How to swap? We have to take three boxes. to swap using third variable this is the third variable called tail so how to swap we put the value of a to the tail so that should be tail equals to a now 10 is come here 10 is 10 comes here now this position is empty now this position is empty now we write down a equals to b then we have to write down a equals to b so that should be that should be that should be found now b equals to 10 So b equals to 10. That third step could be b equals to 10. So that will delete it, and b equals to 10 now. That means that is a. So now the value is swapped. So this was my a, this was my a, and this was my b. So now a and b is swapped. Is it clear to all of you? Yes sir. Yes sir. Yes sir. Okay. Yes. Sir. That that can be done using pointer also. How that can be done? Let we having pointer. So how to do not pointer? We are removing it by. We are removing it by this. That can be m percent of a. We are writing it m percent of a. That means it's the address of a variable. We are writing it m percent of b. So we are writing the m percent of b. M percent of. B. So if we write down this step and remove this step, so that should be our m percent a. M percent A equals to M percent B. M percent A equals to M percent B. So ten equals to M percent A. M 
परसेंट ए इक्वल्स टू एम परसेंट बी देन एम परसेंट बी इक्वल्स टू टेन सो बाय दैट वे आल्सो द वेरिएबल शुड बी चेंज इज इट क्लियर Yes, sir. So for the reason we have to take the variable that will be pointer variable, start temp, not the normal temp. That will be the start temp. That means pointer type of variable. That will be a start temp. Pointer can hold the address like, right? So what is the benefit of using this process? What is the benefit of using this process? That means this process. We are changing whatever value is given. The position will be changed. So that will be generalized. That will be generalized. So whatever value we given at the first place, that will be swapped with the second. So that will be the generalized form. That will be uh, valid. For any values given in the first place and given in the second place, so for the reason we use pointer instead of the value. So that is known as call by reference, and the first one was the call by value. So we are uh, swapping two number by call by reference. That will be generalized form. Okay. So similar type that if we use Cursor over here, we can uh, transfer the program in generalized form. So that can be valid for any other statement. And the another benefit is that by using cursor, we can roll back easily. But if we don't use cursor, we cannot roll back the database. Clear? Yes, sir. Kale, it is generalized form, abe. दो नम्बर एट रोल बैक करा जाए प्रिभिया स्टेजे पाँच हजार टाक सैलारी बाड़िए दिल पर आर मन हलो लसे रान कर कम्पानी आगे सैलारी ती फिर जाए तो जो दस हजार एमप्लय के बाड़िए देा इज इट पसिबल टू चेन्ज द टेन थाउजेंड एमप्लय सैलारी सो जस्ट रईट डाउन वन रोल बैक कमेंट इट उल भी रोल बैक टू द प्रिभिया स्टेज द सैलारी उल भी द प्रिभिया सैलारी इज इट क्लियर Yes, yes. So this is the main utility of the cursor. Bojana, love. Okay. 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 to gain more control over the content area the cursor should be defined in the declaration section and it is created by a select statement so for the select statement uh, explicit cursor can be used so how to use a explicit cursor what are the steps so to do the explicit cursor we have to perform four steps first declare the cursor second open the cursor third fetch the cursor fourth close the cursor there are the four steps so one by one we will do so explicit cursor is defined for select statement okay so cursor name is is select statement open open cursor name fetch fetch cursor name into variable list close cursor name so how to write down those four steps seat declare cid customer type c name customer name c address customer address cursor c customer e select id name address from customers begin open c customers Fetch C customer into C ID, C name, C address, 
when customer not found in the loop that means that will display all the value from the cursor so what we want to see we want to see the id name and address only so id name and address is uh, given up to that cursor so this is the process by using the loop we can display from the from the table by the particular criteria mane ki amra eto din ki korttam normal likhtam select star from table name to joto gulo table e value ache amake dekhiye dilo ebar ami jodi boli je select 100 ta value dekhbo tale amra ki likhbo select select top 100 star from customer to 100 value likhbo kintu ami jodi ei 100 value ke bare bare dekhte chai tale amake bar bar select query run korte hobe কিন্তু কার্সার হলো এমন একটা প্রসেস যাতে আমরা লুপের মতো কাজ করে ভ্যালুগুলো অটোমেটিক্যালি এক্সিকিউট করে দেবে সেটা কি আমরা বলবো এক্সপ্লেসিভ টাইপ অফ কার্সার তাহলে আমরা এটা একটুখানি দেখি প্রোগ্রামটাকে একটু রান করাই তাহলেই বুঝতে পারবো যে কি হচ্ছে দেখো কাস্টমার টোয়েন্টি সেভেন ইজ মাই টেবিল ओके customer name customer and id name and salary address name
Entschuldigung. রান পড়ে গেছে আবার এটাকে আমাকে রিফ্রেশ করতে হবে এখানে যে আউটপুটটা আছে না আউটপুট একবার ক্লিক করুন
फ्रंटेंडेबल एग्जाम्पल um uh, we have fetch the data from the table using a certain criteria and show the data variable using the for loop okay so uh, in that uh, loop we can fetch each and every variable from the database so parser is mainly uh, used for the pointer allocation in the database and second uh, second utility for gui application to fetch any data from the database to the front end html or front end wordpress content okay jodi kono wordpress ba html e front end thake jar back end ta ache oracle diye tahole cursor use kore amra database er value gulo ke front end e dekhte pari okay bojhe gelo जिज्ञासा करो नेक्स्ट क्लस ट्रांजेक्शन करिए डाउट मान जगह पढ़ा मैं नेक्स्ट क्लस एक्साम तार व्यापारे को डाउट आ